just oh that's creepy. Run away. Run away. Oh god. Oh Hello everyone and welcome to another Minecraft tutorial with Can't Stand Ya. Today we are going to build this automated sugarcane farm. Real simple little build, you know. Uh, it's not a huge, it is stackable. Probably, I'm sure you could stack it and you could also expand it. Uh, in many different ways, I'm sure. But uh, it's just a little one so we can make some paper or we can make some sugar to make our... Uh, Maybe we get our elytra, we can make our rockets with that sugar and uh, gunpowder, I believe is what you need both. And uh, yes, yeah, so you can do this so you can make paper to make your books, so you can get your bookcases to make your enchantment table. Anyway, let's get to it, guys. So, what you're going to want to do, well, let's go. I think we got enough room right here. If not, we'll make it. <laughs> So just come down here, anywhere you want to start, and uh, place yourself a chest. You could do a double chest if you wish. And then uh, place a hopper going into that chest. And then you're going to run eight blocks of choice straight down the line here. Four, five, six, seven, eight. And just double check that real quick. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. And then we need some dirt. So let's get uh, let's get the dirt out here real quick. I'm gonna go up one block right there, and we're gonna run eight blocks of dirt along there also. Get rid of that one. Beautiful. Perfect. Okay, so now we'll go jump up here. And we're going to put, we're going to put a block of our choice here, right across here. Actually, I take that back. Let's, let's go back here a minute, sorry. Put a temporary block there. We're going to put a row of blocks on top of that. Eight back as well. Once again, a little temporary block, and a block of choice, eight blocks. And on top of this, we're going to put our pistons facing inward on both sides. Okay, on top of those. We're going to put a, a, a row of observers with the power uh, facing outward and the face of the piston, I'm sorry, of the observer inward. Oops, go around the back. Now you could, if you're doing this in survival, you'll probably want to put uh, this row of box here that we're going to put those down first and then you can jump up there and carefully put those observer blocks on. Sweet. And now we'll take some redstone dust and line it all the way across this block, this row of blocks behind the observer. And what that's going to do is when sugar cane grows up high enough, and that observer observes it, <laughs> it will trigger that redstone, which will trigger all of those pistons and it'll knock them out. And we're going to plant our sugar cane right here. But we got to be able to collect it and we got to be able to hydrate it. So let's, uh, on the back side here, let's put, let's just go like this. And we'll go all the way down with this one. And come all the way up. There we go. It's good for now. This same deal. And 
let's fill this back in right now. Fill this whole back side in. Beautiful. Okay, now let's come around the front. Let's get rid of these temporary blocks we put in. Come around the front. We're going to put a row here as well. And once again, straight down right there. Actually, before we put these in, well, I'll show you a little trick. We can do that. We'll go all the way up, and I did forget to get glass. We need some glass. We're going to put some glass in here. Okay, let's take our water bucket and we'll put a water flowing all the way down to here. And that's beautiful. Perfect. Let's get some glass. Let's see what we have here. We don't need to hop in no more, so let's get our glass. And we're going to put some glass right above the water, all the way up to the and then all the way to the front. Come on. <laughs> trying to do this without flying too much to try to show you how to do it in survival. And then we'll jump up here and we will get uh, I'll have it in here. Get our sugar cane. And we'll just plant it on here. And you could plant it too high to get it kick started, but you know, and I'm gonna do that right now just so we can test it. Okay. And then the same over here. Put our box so we can get up here. So what's going to happen, well, we'll show you later. <laughs> so I'm not going to close this in just yet. Usually I'll put some glass right here and right here and we'll close it in. But we're not going to do that just yet. So now we need to make the collection uh, system. I mean, we got we got a hopper going in the chest, but how are we going to get those out of there when it crushes it? Well, we're going to make this, we're going to take this minecart hopper. We're going to take some rail some powered rail and a lever or two levers for me so we'll crouch put a rail on that hopper put one here and here and there and there we'll come around here and we'll put another one right there another one right there and then we'll put a powered rail right here oops <laughs> powered rail here and we'll dig this block out and we'll put a lever there and power that rail We'll go back to our regular rail and we'll come around all the way around again and then right here we're going to put our power rail dig that out once again put the lever and power it and now we have our railing now we'll take the minecart and we're gonna to have to give this guy a little push so I'm just gonna put it here in the corner we're gonna come around we can't, we don't want to break out this dirt block. We'll break these out right here. There we go. We'll give that a push. And we'll get going. And then he'll just keep going. Perfect. So now let's get our block back out. Our stone brick. And let's replace this. There we go. Beautiful. This one in there too. Okay. So now let's just jump up here. Let's test this thing real quick. Let's get some sugar cane. I'm gonna put one on top here and it should trigger it. Beautiful. The minecart's gonna take it in. Trigger that one. The minecart's gonna take those in. And it's gonna drop them off down here into that hopper. It's gonna do it like one at a time every time it passes by. Which is fine. This is not going to fill that minecart up. <laughs> not this system, huh? Not just these two, that's for sure. It'd take a while to fill that minecart up. So it, it, it it's just going to be just fine, guys. Uh, so 
Now we're just gonna make this sucker look nice, huh? So let's get our building blocks out. We'll put all these other things away. We're gonna need some stairs, some slabs, all all this stuff. Your choice of how you want to do it. Get these trap doors, need some vents, and I think that's it. Yeah, let's get these. This lantern and the torch. Okay, so let's get on up here. And we're gonna put some stone bricks across front here, across the top, sorry, down the center. And I'm just gonna put a torch on uh, each one of these that are over the dirt, just to keep it lit up inside there. Okay, same here. Okay, we don't need that one. This one we're gonna cap off here. Same here. And here as well. Okay. And I'm going to take our stripped, uh, I like to use the stripped oak, dark oak. I'm going to put it like just diagonal to that one right there. Go all the way up here. And I think up one more. Do the same on these corners. Pretty sure this is exactly how I did it, but Okay, guys. So I did one too many on the top on those uh, strip dark oaks. So let's just take that out, and then we're gonna go one more. I think I did one here. One more row here. Same here. It should be six high. We're going to want to fill in, I know we're going to want to fill in right in here with, uh, with the block of choice. Probably a block here, you're not going to see much of it. Well, you'll see a little bit down below, but, and then just bring that all the way up to the same length, same height, I mean. back out here we'll just finish filling this in real quick there we go that's the face now let's get some stairs we're gonna just do some regular stairs here we're gonna take this around here oh <laughs> There you go, I triggered it. <laughs> Not how that ended up over there. And then just continue that around here. And the same here. Come on. There we go. Okay, beautiful. So now let's take some slabs and we're going to put some on here, there, and then we're going to cover all this up. I'm not covering the stairs, we don't need to cover the stairs. Let's cover this whole center up, keep, keep mobs from spawning up here.
I'll just cover these up too. Nice. Okay, and down here, to cover all these up. Oh, actually, we'll bring some more blocks in here. Let's uh, fill all this in. And uh, actually, before we do that, yeah, we want to fill it in right here. go I'll take some upside down stairs and put them up here okay same on the other side and some upside down stairs and then we're going to take this oak, I'm sorry, spruce trap door. We're going to lay them on the floor right here and flip them all up. It's going to give you a base trim. And it's also going to cover up the minecart. But you'll still have access. You can open them up and get access in there if you need to. You can do the same here. And I uh, may have to crouch to do this one. Yeah. And you can still access your chest, even though that's there. There you have it, pretty much. Anyway, let's uh, we're gonna take some oak fence and we're gonna put it in the corners on the back. You could put some here if you want, but I'm not gonna on this one. We'll do some on the front as well. Bring it all the way down. And then one right in the center right there. And then put a lantern on it. And I think we're done. There you have it. And producing sugar cane already. Very nice, guys. Thank you for joining me today. And uh, if you did like what you see, please be sure to hit that like button. Shows me guys are interested in these tutorials. I, uh... I enjoy making them, and I'm only going to get better at uh, <laughs> better at doing them. And I appreciate you guys watching them. So be sure to whack that like button, show your support, comment, share the video as much as you like, put it in your watch later list or, or your favorite list or whatever. That helps out a lot. And if you haven't yet, please please be sure to please consider subscribing, and be sure to hit that uh, notification bell so you'll see all the new videos I put up. Thanks again, guys, and I will see you next time.